Big boobs, big tits. Huge. Outback Steakhouse. Huge tits at Outback Steakhouse. <laughs> now he's ready. Um, oh, let me take these out. I don't know. want the people to think I'm bougie or anything. Yeah, Hello, bougie. guys. Welcome back <laughs> to the podcast. This is Season 5, Episode 16. Alongside me always is John and John. Welcome back on. Thank you. I love to be um, here. You know it. This this week, um, again, we attended. Well, last week we did uh, Patriots training camp. This week we did it again, Part 2, in the stadium. It was very anticlimactic. Yeah. Like my wife in bed. Yeah. Just you're expecting so much from an in. You're literally inside a stadium. You expected more. I did. And these little these little sluts are just dancing. They came and just dancing around. Mm, mm, mm. He needs to be. Like he it. needs to get his back blown out. Dude, by facts Bill. by me. No. Bill, either Bill or Robert Kraft. Just start. Just start. <laughs> if you want to be the QB yeah. one, you gotta start acting like the QB one. <laughs> you gotta act like it, buddy. Dude, that it was very anticlimactic. I would say, I, just felt. I feel it, it didn't felt, feel like it was a practice. It felt it like, like you said it was scripted. It just felt like these these guys went in the locker room. Hey, we're doing this. We're not doing that much today. Get out there and suck some dick. Yeah, they made they probably made so much money though. Well, I mean, everyone buying food. Yeah, buying food. The pro oh shop. God. I mean, Bill, you know. Robert Kraft is a billionaire. I'm going to know that. The guy who went to the Asian massage shop in Florida. Yeah, that's how you remember him. He, how much do you think he paid for that? Like realistically, probably cheap. That's probably chump change to him though. Whatever like he, he paid, he had to have paid like, like, at least like five hundred. That's it. How much? The like, how think much about think, think about it. They have to blow an old guy. Dude, they'll take any any dollar you thrown at him. So do you think they, did it? they just did it for like sucky sucky five dollar? Yeah, they might have five dollar. Like, I give you a sucky <laughs> sucky. I can't believe they put surveillance cameras in there, bro. Dude, they, they fucking. That's- that's what I don't get. Like you were really putting surveillance. Isn't there like there? surveillance like footage of them like just him just getting blown thoroughly? He's like, oh, <laughs> she's like, oh, sucky sucky five dollars. Like, 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 there's like they have like the actual interaction. He's like, how much for you to blow me? She's like, sucky sucky five dollar. <laughs> He's like, what? Sucky sucky five dollar. Oh, five dollar. That's what they're doing. But oh, speaking yeah. of dementia, does Joe Biden have dementia? I wouldn't be surprised, dude. The other day I was in Walmart and there was a magazine where like Biden's mouth was wide open. He's like. And it's like the caption was, "Does Joe Biden have dementia?" Really? Yeah. There's, I think there's actually an article on it, but uh, it's a closer look at Biden's health, uncertainty, and contention surround the presidential election a mere days away. But there's one thing we know for sure: no matter who wins, the, oh, this is like a while ago. This is October twenty. It's crazy how like you have to be what thirty five to even run to be president. Yeah, that's crazy. I mean, that, like that's like your prime years, but like if you're 70, bro. Like, I think there should be a cap. I think there should be a cap of 70. I think, yeah, I think there should be like. Because you, sh- you want to get new ideas in there. Yeah, you, you want can't, new you people. Can't be, you can't be like a past a certain age to be president. Yeah. He's 74. Oh, no, 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 no. Joe Biden's 78. Yeah. What the fuck? My grandma's in that, basically. That's crazy, but we do have a new rig set up today where I have the uh, laptop connected to the TV. It looks a lot better, to be honest with you. I like it. Where I can just scroll and it just... It's not like that laggy, but look at that face. <laughs> look at him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was the picture they used. Dude, I want to be surprised. That was crazy. I think he might have something. He, like... Maybe he does, maybe he doesn't, but, like, all I know is that Sleepy Joe loves chocolate chocolate chip. That's the... Funniest video on TikTok I've seen in dude, so no. long. The funny, so the fun, long. dude. How, what, chocolate, what is the thing chip. he says? Greater national depression. I'll lead an effective strategy to mobilize true international effort to pressure. <laughs> what is, where, hold on, hold on. <laughs> you gotta find it. Oh my god, mumbling, mumbling video, dude. It's hilarious, dude. You know how many, you know how many videos are gonna pop up with Joe Biden mumbling video? <laughs> it's this one. It's this one. It's this one. How do you? Shouts gibberish. I'll lead an effective strategy to mobilize true and international effort to pressure. <laughs> I'll lead an effective strategy to mobilize true and international effort to pressure. And you know, you know hey, Donald, where Trump, you, Donald Trump, Donald Trump, Trump put it there. Hey, you pretty sure they put a uh, closed caption. I'll lead an effective strategy to mobilize unintelligible. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe oh. he actually posted it. That's hilarious. Oh my god! Now this was obviously a b- before the election. That's why. I- <laughs> I'll lead an effective strategy to mobilize international depression. I love Joe Biden, bro. I'll lead an effective strategy to mobilize true international effort to pressure. It's just funny. Chocolate, chocolate. It's, it's the, the first, first thing that pops that up. Pops up. 
Because this is the funniest clip. Oh my god. I don't care about Best Buy. Skip the ad. Horrible deals, by the way. Best Buy can. Oh yeah. Let me let me get like my let me get a laptop right and then get a yoga mat for free so I can get railed on railed over on it while I'm getting my fucking student <laughs> debt. Do you actually get a yoga mat for free? I just, I just saw a yoga mat. The news junkies cartoon. Imagine you see like the two security guards with like like uh, ice cream too. Yeah. Looks awfully good. What did you get? Would you would you would you get, Joe? Would you get Shredder and Depression? We're so excited what you're doing for the country. Hi! Mr. President, what did you order? Chocolate chocolate chip. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Each of chocolate chip. You love like, it. Who the fuck says that? I love it. Holy shit! But uh, speaking of just downfalls, not even, it's not even a downfall. It's just it's just like bro, like you're really like fucking out here. I love it. Like you're like you have to respond to serious questions. Like eat some chocolate, chocolate, chocolate chip. chip, and they just the Republicans start doing it. <laughs> this is so good. Thanks, Biden. But obviously, my brother uh, yesterday. I was at I was at home. My mom was cooking cooking you know a little nice little lunch obviously you know yeah, of course. chicken rice broccoli whatever the usual the usual yeah and then my mom gets a call and saying that my brother fucking little in his knees playing board square can I hear that again little <laughs> it, like he literally heard like a loud pop like the way he, I don't know what it is he went to go dive for it and like he fell on his like leg weird it was so it was so weird and then he gets. Goes to the hospital. They can't even give X-rays anymore, and so yeah. he's like, "Where am I going now? I'm going to Joe Biden's house to get some chocolate, <laughs> chocolate, chocolate chip, chip and some X-rays." <laughs> yeah, but he did that. Uh, he finally got to go uh, get the X-rays done, and it was just uh, a sprain in the MCL and then his meniscus. Not bad. Six weeks, though, right? Recovery time? I don't know. He said it's not that bad. He just can't lift heavy weight and stuff like that. He, I mean, he went to camp today, so that was good. Did he? Yeah, went to camp, came home, did his interview. Kicked. I'm pretty sure he probably kicked ass the interview. I mean, he goes to Parker. If he becomes like a middle school teacher at Parker, is, is that that's, what the interview for? Up, yeah, that's easier. It's, an, it's a quick trip for him. Yeah. Goes, it's so much easier. Probably gets paid more too, but yeah. But he blew his knee out playing Fort Square. I was wondering what the interview was for. Yeah, that's what it was for. It was for uh, he wanted to be a teacher at Parker oh, for him. Middle School. More, I think it's more uh, pay raise and uh, it's close just close commute. Yeah, yeah it's I think the, the, the commute where he was taking was like a half an hour drive. Every day, damn. Yeah, every day, and just half an hour drive to be a mon- minority at a school. Just fucking. Yeah, I know. He's like, oh, just sucking a dick, <laughs> but. Um, now is a part of the show where we answer your questions. You guys send us in questions every week. I love this. Um, they get they get unreal every fucking they week. Do. You guys are literal animals. Um, more more what and do, more people keep responding. What do we wait, 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 What do we write? What do we? What is this? What is this? Oh my god! I oh, hate geez. Kyle. I what do we write on the front? I wrote a. Uh, she take my money when I'm in need. Yeah, baby. I've been like on like such a Kanye kick recently. I love it. Ever since Donna never fucking came out. I've been watching like a lot of documentaries on Kanye too. I watched the Joe Rogan podcast with Kanye as well. He's a great guy. Yeah, he's, he's very just, smart. He, he has. Um, I love when he said, um, "I tell the truth in a world full of lies." Yeah. That literally, like, I literally got rock hard, <laughs> like Viagra tips from last week. But <laughs> we'll start off. Question one from Kyr underscore Speedy. This isn't a question, but he just says ketchup is actually a soda. Really? That's literally what he said. Ketchup is actually a soda. Yo, K Ry, K Y R, Speed. I don't know what you drink. I don't know if you send us some of this. Yeah, uh, ketchup soda. This, yeah, this ketchup soda. Because, I mean, you know, I've actually like there was one time I worked at Gillette where I was having chicken tenders and fries. You know, the classic. Whatever. Yeah, Ma- Mountain Dew. Yeah. Before it was just a cold, cold December. Like just one o'clock game. Like drinking, oh, drinking ketchup. Drinking ketchup. No, the ketchup was like literally like carbonated almost. Really? It had like a bite to it a little bit. I'm like, bro, this shit is diesel. <laughs> you like that? I was, yeah, I was like, this is like so weird, but it's so good. <laughs> I don't know what they did to it, but it kind of had like the carbonation of like a soda. Dude, speaking of carbonation, I, I, my mom went to Trader Joe's like two days ago. I love Trader Joe's. Love Trader Joe's. Big fan. And she got me orange juice. Some big orange juice guy. I love it in the morning. Facts. I tried to open it yesterday and like try to take a sip before we went to the range or to try to go golfing. Yeah. Um. 
the thing was carbonated. And I, it was the grossest orange juice thing I've ever had in my life. Did you... Was your mom, like, was your mom home at the time? No. Oh my god, you should say, Diane, get back here right now. And you take, the, you take it and just dump it on her head. Be like, Dude, it was nasty. Don't bring me carbonated orange juice ever again. It was I love you, mom, gr- but seriously. Dude, it was just so nasty. I like, I had, I just threw it away. Like, I had a sip and I was like, the f- I would have brought it back this? to the store and then dump, I just literally... Dumped it on Trader I would have came head. inside that and then put the bottle back. Mm. Dump other orange juice in it and just put the bottle back and then leave. <laughs> and then they come, the it. police come to my house and they're like, where's John Noonan? Like, who's John Noonan? Like, not me. Not me. I'm not John. I'm uh, <laughs> I'm Pat Newton. Yeah. You can find John Newton somewhere else though. Anyone ask the next question? Yeah. From what's it, Newt Newt? Do you know that? Do you know that, that reference? No. Newt Newt. From uh, Pengu, like that show, like that Japanese show where like they had the penguins. Newt Newt. Oh yeah. 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 Okay. Um, how do you feel about pineapple on pizza? Never had it. Um, I'm not a fan. I I just don't <laughs> think the two mix together. I'm a big fan of pineapple and I'm a big fan of pizza, but. I never never put them together. I like never had. I mean, you could probably think the combo, like the sweetness, and then like it combining with the cheese and like the sauce. I mean, me, I don't know. I never had it, but it sounds pretty interesting. Um, I want to play this for a second. The Newt Newt. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. I can't like. <laughs> I, I wish I watched this as a kid. Obviously, I, I don't understand what they're even saying, but I just watched four minutes of a clay penguin nuding, and I don't regret it. <laughs> when Newt Newt is so strong, it shatters your skull. That's awesome. But that's where that his name originates from. But I like it. That was Mason. Mason changed his name on TikTok. Really? Mason underscore four or four two. Huh. All right. From Newt Newt is cereal soup. No. I mean, you could class maybe. Think about it. Milk. Then the cereal. Think about think about this. Like a like a like a soup. Ready? It's uh what's it? Like a broth. Cla- chicken noodle. Chicken, chicken noodle. noodle. You got broth, and then you have the noodles, and then chicken. obviously chicken. But you have cereal. You have milk, and then you have cereal. It's it's like the same kind of kind of thing, but it's not like a soup is warm. You know, it could be. It's just it wouldn't make any sense. You know. I just don't see it as a soup, but I get, I get, if you want to classify it, I'll say, boy, it's, a you can argue. I'll say it's a cereal I'm soup. I'm going to say it's not a soup. Well, I, fuck you. I can't, I can't say it's a soup. Your wife's a soup. I think it, um, new, new, I think it could be considered uh, a soup. It's just the world's not ready to hear that. I'm not ready to hear that yet. Give, not me, ready. give me like two, three years. I mean, give it three years and this literally be, this, there'll be a bill passed to Congress that'll say it's cereal is soup. If I ever become president, that's going to be my, my bill. Cereal is soup. Yep. And then they're going to be like, this guy, John, he's honestly, like, you know, the best comp- president. He's, he, he's competing for Joe Biden as chocolate chocolate chip <laughs> yeah. versus is cereal a soup. <laughs> well, I love it. Want to answer the yeah, next one? Yeah. Uh, from Newt Newt again. Shout out Newt Newt for all the questions. We Shout love out it. Newt keep, Thank you. keep sending these. Toilet paper over or under? I'm an over guy. What does he mean by over? Like when it hangs, is it that is the roll over coming oh, it's, towards it's you? Or over. Is it under? It's over. It's it's gotta it's, be over it's for over. me. Yeah, it's kind of weird if it's under. I mean, I've done it sometimes by accident, you know. I like it over. And then I scream at my mom like, ah, <laughs> be like 4 a.m. Like, what the fuck is this shit? My dad, like, my dad's about to wake up for work. He's like, what the fuck you want? <laughs> the toilet paper is under. <laughs> What the fuck? Oh my god. Sitting there with fucking just poop on my ass cheeks. I'm like, I'm not wiping until someone changes this. <laughs> but, yeah. Fair. Over. That's I mean, fair. Here you go, my sir. If I just got, let's say theoretically, I just got engaged or I got married, you know, the wedding. And my wife, like puts the fir- first day of the house, puts it under, I'm divorcing her and I'm taking all of her money. Yep. I like it. I like, I'm going to tell, tell her parents and she'll be like, their parents be like, I completely understand. Dumbass didn't put it fucking over. It's got to be over. It can't be under. Exactly. And then they literally actually kicked the kicked the daughter out. Now she's homeless. Congratulations. All that one decision. Dude, you play up. stupid games and win stupid prizes. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> From your mom is at my house. Your mom is at my house sucking me off. Hey yo, check you PG thirteen here. Jesus man, fucking. Did you get my permission first? Yeah. Like. Did you even ask her? We need. We need the permission slip. I don't know. Did you get a permission slip? I didn't get one. I didn't um, get one. Maybe. So my mom's definitely not at your house. Yeah, she must not be sucking you off at your house, buddy. From your mom is at my house. This, this guy. <laughs> fuck this, this guy, guy just, bro. This, this guy just loves saying it. He just I loves love saying it. it. I guess. Thanks for the question. I, I do. 
from Ron Jeremy. Best ass on a female you have ever seen. It's a great question. <sighs> um, what do you want to do? Real ass or just you know just regular ass in general? Because like, there's also girls that get like you know. I we don't count the we want real only. Oh man, this is a great question then. Um, person first person that comes to mind always is Summer Rae. I was gonna say Summer Rae is always um, a, a, a given. Daisy Daisy is it Daisy Keach? Daisy Peach? I don't know the last name. I don't know Daisy Peach. You gotta look it up now. She check my booty. Well, I'm a knee. I think it's Daisy Keach. Yeah, it is. Look at this. I don't know Daisy Keach. She is this the girl with Big Cheek? Oh. Well, I'm a no. knee. Oh. Hold hey. up, hold up. There are, there are good pictures, I promise you. I gotta, I just gotta no, type something in. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Mm, 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 mm. I like that first video. Mm, 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 mm. The first picture. Yeah, I I'm give pretty it to sure her. she's like, like she has a real butt too. It's not like there's anything wrong with it. Oh my um, lord, Dad! She took my money. Well, I'm Are you sure it's real? That dude, that thing. No, is. no, she literally went to a doctor and got it tested. Or you could do. Hear me, hear me out, already. Hold up, hold up. There's better pictures. I don't, um, I don't know this girl either. You know Julia Rose? No. You don't really know Julia Rose? I don't. You s fucking animal. She took my money. Where is it? She has like no pictures of her butt. So does one. She's, she's got plenty <laughs> of pictures of that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> so stupid. I'm probably going to say Summer right? I mean, you can't, you can't go wrong. I think it's a classic personally. Yeah, I know. Like who? Like who else did you even have in mind? Yeah, I don't think I have anyone in mind. She take my like that's just like wow. I know, bro. It's like Jesus. Like yeah, chill. I'm, I'm, I, if what is this? What's chill the question? Ow. Best on a female you've ever seen. I, I'm gonna summary. Uh, you can't beat that. It's hard. Look at this one. Yeah, like God damn. Oh, oh, Lord. Save, save that for later. Thank God I plugged in the HDMI. Yeah. This is fucking so much bigger, so bigger now. Fuck yeah. Uh, I got the last question. Last question from Gray Greggy. Hey, Greggy. How come when I ask my stepsister to fuck, she won't do it? Please, I need answers. With three exclamation points. This guy really Dude. wants to know. Um, How would you go about this, Andrew? You know, what I would probably do, and it's the best solution, is probably, I want to give, like, a like a fucking retarded answer, but I just can't do it. I was, should I, should I just yeah, give just it? Fuck it? What yeah. you should do is, you know, depending if you're, like, 21, you know, if, if, if you're oh, not. this is my idea. If you're, this is what I was going to say. If you're, if you're not, like, 21, <laughs> yeah. don't do this, but it just, get, just like, the family you're drinking, just get, just get a really drunk, Yeah. You know? Um, that's literally what I was thinking. It's the only way it's going to happen, you know, but you can't be, I mean, you can try to be drunk, but I wouldn't, you know, but just be drunk, uh, get her drunk, you know, and then there's your sleepy time boning, but I mean, I mean, you don't do it, yeah, you know, know, but like, that's like the only like case scenario if you really want to do it and then it's just going to be awkward. Um, if she's hot, yeah, I mean, why not? Yeah, why not get your sister drunk and fuck her? Yeah. Why not? Makes sense. Step. Step. Step sister. Yeah, you but gotta it's still, it's still, yeah, but it's still another person that you're just fucking... Nah. Nah. No way. I don't know. Um, yeah, just get really drunk and then just see what happens. You know? That was what I was going to say. I know. It's, we're so fucked up. Literally, that's that. exactly what I was going to so say. so fucked up. Don't do... Uh, uh, no, do don't, that. Don't, 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 don't do anything do we say. Um, you know? Yeah, we are the worst <laughs> people to do. Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> don't take it away too um, much. If I... Uh, uh, I've never been in a situation like where I've had a stepsister that like you know it just doesn't like would you like, if you had a hot stepsister like, yeah, so, yes, se yep, yep. seriously you don't even you had a yes. hot stepsister yes would you fuck them yes I don't think I would yes I did <laughs> it's not blood related I know but it's just still fucking weird mm. like at the dinner table like oh how honey uh, you okay oh yeah no my step bro just fucked the shit out of me before we came down here I love it. Or like, like if you seen those videos, have you seen those videos? Oh yeah. What a family. Little fucking Fast and Furious yeah. kind of thing. The Fast and Furious. Yeah, bro. It's family. Diesel. It's family. Did you just say family? I love this. <laughs> Tom Toretto. <laughs> oh. It's oh man, I don't. I just <sighs> fuck these, these fucking questions. I man. love them. Keep them coming. These Thank you for the questions. questions. It's just yeah, they're taking advice from people they shouldn't. Yeah, no, don't take advice from us. But but keep asking us questions. Yeah, keep asking questions. They always get. 
Weirder and weirder every week. Obviously, shout out to Newt Newt for carrying this week. That was yeah, awesome. Yeah, dude, Newt Newt with the three um, questions. Shout a lot, out to yeah, him. A lot of questions. Ask multiple uh, questions. Yeah, everyone. Just, everybody, just ask questions. Again, thanks to questions, guys. But you, I think you've probably seen Luca's crazy max contract. I. It was two hundred seven. <laughs> Let's see right here. It was two oh seven for five five years. Look at all these fucking fiber energy ads that are around it, bro. Oh, everyone wants five hour energy. <laughs> Dude, the, oh my god, that's the, the <laughs> biggest ad I've ever seen in my life. When's the last time you had a five hour energy? Where, have you even had one? Uh, no, I haven't. I've never had one. I saw it when I was in like elementary school. My teacher would literally just bust one open at like uh, after lunch or recess or something. Like, bro, are you really that down bad, bro? <laughs> but yeah, um, five years, two hundred seven million. That's crazy money. I know. But like, how much is Mahomes getting? Mahomes getting like, what? 10? Ten years, five hundred million. Oh, okay. Well, fuck, fuck him. Well, that's still like almost like half the money he's getting, but just in less years. Yeah, that's really crazy. I mean, is it also like what's guaranteed? You know, that's true. I don't know if it's all guaranteed. Don, uh, how do you say his last name? Doncic. Uh, Doncic. Doncic, is that what you say? Yeah. Said in a statement per uh, I don't know his name, the reporter. Today is a dream Whoa. come true. It's like Woj, yeah. Yeah, I call him the Woj mom because that's all he does. Woj moms. Adrian Woj. Today is a dream come true. The game of basketball has given me so much and has taken me to so many amazing places. I am humbled and excited to remain in Dallas as part of the Maverick and appreciate the support of my fans. Along with this new contract, I am also happy to announce that I am increasing my efforts and focusing on expanding the Luka Doncic Foundation. The, my foundation is an international nonprofit that will give back to places that mean so much to me, like my home country of Slovenia, as well as the communities in North Texas. Wow, I mean, he deserves it. He plays. He plays really well. He's a very good basketball player. Great guy. Um, what is this? Is that poop? Am I seeing poop in the ad? I think that might that's have been. crazy. But that's awesome. Also, the Celtics signed someone yesterday. We got Dennis Schroeder on a absolute steal. We only give him five point like eight I know, million they tell a us year. Give, uh, well, the uh, Lakers give him like eighty four for, for five for years. Yeah, bro, that's fucking crazy. We snagged him. People are saying that, uh... People can call him stupid. That's not a stupid move. No, no, yeah, they're saying it's an L because he got it's less money. Maybe he just uh, did dude, not want to... he doesn't want to be there. Yeah, does he not want to play with LeBron or something? He didn't... If you look at his stats, he significantly went down when he played with LeBron. He did really good when he's on OKC. That's unreal. But uh, dude, I'm, I'm fine with that. That's a good pickup for us. I'll take that. What position does he play? Like, I think he's a forward. We need forwards? We don't really have anyone off the bench, so he's a good bench player. He's going to be very upset playing bench, going off the bench like that. But, I mean, it's what he's going to have to do. Oh, he was going to come off the bench if he played a whatever. You know what? I want to go back to the days where, before Kevin Durant was a Golden State Warrior, just relive that. Just we almost had in, him. In the summer, just fucking Julian Edelman's posting. He's in a fucking KD yeah. fucking jersey. He's like, oh, yeah. I do. I'm so I pissed like we didn't get that. I feel like if I don't think he, w- he would have been. We would have won one. I don't think. I, don't I think, think we would have won one. Kyrie would have came, too. Kyrie would have been happy. Kyrie wanted another superstar. We couldn't get one. We would have had Al. We got Gordon Hayward uh, for had, him. We would have had Al. Yeah, but Gordon Hayward was good until he fucking snapped his ankle. That, I know. That, that was, ruined everything yeah, for him. I know. Poor that guy. did. He's still good. He's not bad. But like, yeah, he's it's just, like he was so much better before the injury. He was so injury. nasty before it's his crazy. injury. It's crazy. Crazy what injuries can do to people. Like Robert Griffin was a Heisman winner. Yeah. Fucking just, uh, gone. <laughs> um, Who else had an injury that was just, that's just not good anymore? Uh, I feel like David Johnson, he was good, really good on point, and then he got the injury on the Texans now. That was, okay, that was the worst trade I've ever seen in, in sports history. DeAndre Hopkins. Straight up. DeAndre Hopkins. And then he ended up getting fired, that coach. Yeah. That's that crazy. was a, Okay, that was a stupid ass trade, though. Would you? I would never do that ever no, in my life. Madden, Madden wouldn't even accept that trade. Yeah. <laughs> Like, that is so unfair. It's not even fun. I don't know how they got away with that. It's so funny. Oh, my God. That's ridiculous. You know that uh, Jefferson got hurt in practice, right? Did he? Yeah, he's a sprained shoulder, I think. It'll be day-to-day. He's going to be... Oh, he's day-to-day? Yeah, it'll be, it'll be good for week one, I think, but it was just kind of unfortunate because he's also, like, a thin guy. He's not the biggest. Somebody, I'm, I'm scared for Devonta Smith. He's very small. Dude, I know. Like he's very thin. Like he's if he's going across the middle, bro, he's gonna get lit up. He's gonna get lit up like that Brandon Cooks hit in the Super Bowl. Oh, that was so fucking awful. I don't know where he was running, so that's his fault. But part of the ball. He's going side to side. He's just just boom. Yeah. He's like, oh, where am I? You know what? Th- they would have won that Super Bowl if he didn't go hurt. I feel like. Oh, absolutely. I think they would. have. Like Philly, Philly played good. Like we surprisingly, beat him. I'm so I like I called it beginning of the year. I was this one I was working with Baron. I was like, there's this guy that I work with. Big Eagles fan, I'm like I'm telling you, bro. Nick Foles is leading you guys to Super Bowl. He's like, shut up. I'm like, 
I'm gonna, ki- I'm gonna kiss you if he does yeah. <laughs> and then he's like, like oh my god we have to kiss now I'm like yeah I'm not kissing you dirty boy he's oh. like I want it so bad though please I'm like <laughs> do you miss your LeBaron like, days eh, a little bit not really but do you miss the atmosphere yeah bro, it was electric yeah it was like walking uh, Madison Square Garden like a WWE <laughs> night the Royal Rumble, Rumble Royal just, Rumble. oh my god I was <laughs> walking his name is John Cena <laughs> walking fucking dishwashers packed to the brim oh, yeah. after I get out of school I'm like Ugh. Let's fucking do it, dude. That must fucking have been tough. Bro, you know, you remember Brian? Yeah, I know. He's he's Batista. Yeah, yeah, he's Batista. Or he's uh, or actually, or you want to put him as Edge? He could be, yeah, he could be Ed. Nah, I don't. Triple X, maybe. Or Triple. H- oh my god, Triple H. I think. I think it's Triple H. Yeah. Or he's uh. I do. I haven't. I don't. I don't. WWE yeah, I didn't. So, I never really watched it when I was a kid. I never did, did either. No, I didn't. My parents. <clears throat> my parents never got me into that. <laughs> Like I, I had a bubble stuck in my throat, and I just made my voice sound weird, so I had to swallow. I, I love, yeah. I love when you get like a voice crack or something. You just go, you go yeah, you go, yeah, bro. I get, I get, I, I'll have a voice crack, like, huh, and I go, huh. I love yeah. it. Yeah, it's so funny. Cause I just want to recorrect, like, recorrect, bro. Like my body did, like, bro. Like I'm 20 years old. Fucking drop already, bro. bro. <laughs> my nuts are still up there, fucking hibernating. You're like, waiting for the, yeah, <laughs> fucking dropping down. <laughs> Uh, fucking Christ but uh, we're gonna hop back into uh, actually you wanna hop into this last one yeah what is I that I need to change my underwear so it's wet so I was at the dinner table my mom was there oh god yeah I know this is where it gets weird it was it's hot obviously it's really hot so yeah. she says to me I need to change my underwear it's so wet I'm like mom I'm cooking food don't say that yeah that's you say that again you get you getting back in front of it. and then I'm <laughs> gonna I'm gonna RKO you in the pool and then you're gonna like, like oh I'm gonna feed you gluten too Oh wow! I need. To, you gonna put glue? What would you do if like your mom said that to you? I would be like, "Hey yo," and I just would literally just flame her and then leave. <laughs> just pack your bags and leave. Yeah, mom, I'm sleeping in my car. Yeah, I'm not sleeping here anymore. <laughs> you can't be saying that with me around. <laughs> you can't be saying that. Do you still have those lights when you open up the car at night? At the, the flash? At I the... did, but they um, the the batteries, the like I don't know, it like didn't they don't work anymore? They don't work anymore? No, I wish those things were sick. That's awful. Oh hey, oh yeah. Franchises. <clears throat> okay. We got. We're gonna do tier list today, ladies and gentlemen. I love it. Um, I wish they could see it, but actually, let me try this real quick. She take my money when I'm in need. Let's see if I can do this real quick. Get some OBS going. Hey. So you can screen record my screen and then. All right, let's open. Let's get rid of all these. <laughs> I just saw the fucking chocolate chocolate chip, and it made me fucking go crazy. Later, chocolate chocolate chip. Bro, I wish I had like an actual PC to stream off of, and I wish I also had games that were fun to play. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Maybe they like the games are fun to play, but we're just kind of growing out of video games. Dude, I just don't think we. I just think the games suck. There's like people that actually really enjoy games. Like you see Nick Merckx, he'll literally play like 16 hours. He, he played 12 hours yesterday of just Apex. I can't. Well, I think he put Apex and put the FNCS Cup, Fortnite Cup. Dude, I wish. Like, it's crazy. Like, I wish I had that same passion for it. But also, he like does that as a job. But it's like, it's different. I don't know. If I was getting paid to do that, I'd... Well, no, you have on. to enjoy the game first, and then you that comes with it, you know? I don't even care if I enjoy the game. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you gotta enjoy it, I'm sorry. Yeah, hold on. If I was getting paid to play video games, I would enjoy the game because I'm getting paid to do it. Even if I wasn't getting paid, like there's some things that yeah, I, no, I know there's just some games that like aren't that good anymore though. Like oh, I already had like OBS. Warzone. Dude, Warzone was Warzone. fun. They fucking ruined yeah, it. Yeah, they, they had s- a great foundation. They said, "Hey, you guys want to see something funny? What? We're gonna run this game for you." All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna do tier lists here today. So the first one we're gonna do is NFL tier list maker. 32 NFL teams. We'll rank them the best we can. Starting off with the Tennessee Titans. Where would you put the Tennessee Titans after the offseason they've had this year? Um, I think that, I think I put them at A or B. I think mainly maybe B for, and for me. I don't know where you would put them. They did really good in the offseason. I don't like Ryan Tannehill. But I don't think Ryan Tannehill is a uh, playoff QB. Or a Super Bowl contender. They're not Super Bowl He's contenders. not crazy. Um, no. But, all right, next one, Miami. I love their defense. I think Miami could be an A. I think Miami is an A. I like that. Um, 
Brian Flores, great coach. Um, they're, they're just defense. a little skeptical this year on uh, Tua. That's really about it. But I mean, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I don't know what he's going to do or how he's going to do. All right, next one here: Cleveland Browns, sneaky A. I think I like the Browns. Good I, defense. I think they have a good offense going. The, I like Baker. I'm a Baker fan. <laughs> I know you might not be a Baker. I'm a big Baker I don't fan. I like Baker Mayfield. I think he's a good player. Um, next got the Jaguars. I think I'm putting my like C. Not C, a lot so of I high think hoops. C for now. Yeah, um, I want to see what yeah. Trevor Lawrence does. Yeah, we got to see what the, the team does this year. Lions. D. <laughs> I don't even want to say nothing. I don't even want to say nothing. Uh, I'm going to say uh, Vikings. I'll put a B. I, put, I, I would put that at C. No, actually B, because Justin Jefferson. Dalvin Cook. Yeah, Justin Jefferson, Dalvin, Dalvin Cook. Dalvin Cook is crazy. Uh, Buccaneers. Hey, Tom Brady, Antonio Brown. I'm Dad. putting an S. Oh, that's uh, that's twenty men. Sorry, I thought it was top. San Fran, B, B. B. Uh, Atlanta. I think with the addition this sheet. Who did they pick up? They got Kyle Pitts. Did they? They got Mike Davis now too. I, I don't. Know, I B. don't know, bro. I, I think put him at B. B for now. Baltimore, give an A. Bears. <laughs> good defense. If we're giving the Falcons a B, I'm giving the Bears a B. I think the Falcons are a soft B, hard A. I mean, Bengals, hard C, hard C. Could be an A. Really could be. Yeah, they could be. I'll give him an A. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to give him that. <laughs> uh, Cowboys, I think B. Uh, no, C. <laughs> really? With CeeDee Lamb? Mari Cooper? Yeah. Micah Parsons? I'm giving him a B. I don't like the Eat Cowboys the like that. D. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Giving them a D. Uh, Colts, oh, it could be. I think A. I like the you defense. Think a? They got great defense. I love uh, Jonathan oh, Taylor. Yeah. Rams. A. Yep. Can't go wrong. It could be an S tier team. They they got Stafford. They potentially no. had. Yeah, they potentially had. I, don't, I wouldn't. I wouldn't put him. I would, no, no, no. I want to see what Stafford does. Put him in. A. Yeah, but he's. I think he's better than golf. He is better than golf, but I want to see how he does. Chargers. Where is it? Hold up. Yeah, I was gonna say. Chargers, they got a. A. Justin Herbert's very good. Chiefs S tier. You know how it goes. Saints. A. A. Oh, could be a B team too this year. I think a B. Mm. No Michael Thomas now. He wants to be traded. No Drew Brees. Kam- right? They still got Kamara. Um, I give him B. Yeah, I'd put him B. New York, uh, give him. A, I give him a B. Phil- fair, Philadelphia. Fair. Yep. Pittsburgh. St- I give him an A. Get out of here. Denver. <laughs> they have a good defense. Yeah. I give him B. I think Green Bay is an A. Yes. Carolina. Uh, I think they're an average team. We got McCaffrey. He's great. Raiders. Get out of here. Yeah. Yep. Washington. I think they, I like they're an Washington. A team. I, think I really an a like team. Washington. Actually, Arizona. I think they're they're an A team. I ooh, I would put Arizona great, B. Great offense. I like it though. Ready for this one? Bills S tier. Yeah. I, I hate to uh, say it, but yeah. Seattle. B. You think so? I think B with Metcalf and Wilson. They're wasting. Chris Carson. With, yeah, they're wasting. Yeah, but, I, they're wasting his prime years. Yeah, so but they're good I though. I, mean, I know a, they're good, but they don't like produce in the off season. Other than Legion of Boom, that was it. Mm. But they don't have that anymore. I put him. At, I put him at A. Russell Wilson's a great quarterback. The first like six Jets. weeks of the season every yeah. year. Uh, Patriots. Yeah. I think right now. But um, overall, overall, like you know, franchise. I was gonna say if, it's, if we're doing overall franchise, we're just doing now before yeah, the, the season comes. So this is our tier list right here. Before this, you want to do one after the season to see what yeah, things have changed. We'll that'd do, be yeah. really so cool. So that's that's our tier list right there for the season. Oh, look at that. the camera's already going. Oh boy, I like it. Create a fruit tier list. Oh, avocado. Um, B. B. I've never had I apple. Like S tier. Yep. Bananas. S tier. Uh, Blackberry. Uh, Blackberry. I've never had it. Mm, C. C, you think so? Yeah. Blueberries. Uh, ST. What do you think about this? Cantaloupe. Cantaloupe's A. Cantaloupe? Yep. Cherries? S tier. Grapes? S tier. Passion fruit? Uh, or pomegranate, sorry. I never had one before. Never had D has never had it. Mangoes? Uh, yeah. Oranges? S. Peaches? S. Pineapple? S. No idea what this is. Uh, cranberry? Yeah. D. I never had a cranberry. I can straight up cranberry before. Like strawberries, S. Come on. Watermelon's S, too. Yeah. A lot of S's here. Well, Loving there's that. just a lot of good fruits, I feel like. The last one we're going to do, guys, is going to be Call of Duties. Yeah. Um, soup, uh, double S tier, S tier, A, B, C, and trash. Call of Duty Ghost. B. That campaign was so good. 
talk to me. You can extinction. N- I don't even care. I don't C. care. I think it goes. No, C. that thing's that campaign was the best camp, like one of it the best campaigns. It was a good campaign, but like, ju- you, yeah, it, but- following the hype of Black Ops Two and Modern Warfare Two, you're gonna have a bad game. If we got if we got that game now in 2021, I'd who be, made, who, I'd be who, happy. Who made this game? The people who made Modern Warfare's. Exactly, it's a good game. You guys just hated it. I think it was Sledgehammer. I think that was Sledgehammer's exactly. first game. Sledgehammer sucks, Wiener. No, Sledgehammer's first I game was. I gave it a C. That that game bro. was so good. I, I, okay, I, I, all I, it was was the campaign. The the multiplayer, multiplayer was fun. Doo-doo. No, the multiplayer Extinction, was fun. Extinction. I played once. Guess what I did? I deleted Extinction. It's Extinction was fun too. You have to give I'll put, a try. I'll put a B for now, but that's horrible. That's Call of World War Two trash. Yeah. Um, did you play this one, Modern Warfare 4? I did. What was it? I, I give it an A. Is that Nintendo DS? Bro? That's the start of Call of Duty. That's Infinite the start. Warfare. Yeah, there you go. Black Ops 3, I liked a lot for zombies. I put it as S. Zombies is good. Multiplayer was good. Campaign was okay. Uh, Modern I, Warfare 2. I, S, S. Double S. Yep. Uh, World of War, did you put that? I did. I put it an A. Your campaign was good, but I, I don't know. Black okay. Ops, S or S tier? S. Double S. Just S. S. Black Ops 4. M B A. I like. I didn't mind it. I liked it. Zombies was doo doo. Campaign was kind of iffy. Yeah. Uh, multiplayer was probably good. There I was never, no campaign. Never, but there was no campaign. And that one no. That's fucking. That's awful. It's because it was blackout. All right. So we got three more. Modern Warfare three. S S. Think so. Yep. Black Ops two. S S. S S. And then Infinite trash. War. Trash. All right. So that is our Call of Duties there. Um, I hope you guys did enjoy this episode for this week. If you guys did, make sure yeah. to subscribe. Um, Tell me help. if you enjoy Call of Duty Ghosts because some yeah. people here don't Listen, like, I, I, I love the game. I love the I love campaign, the but the multiplayer and extinction was just not it. I know it ruined. ruined. I know. But okay. thank you guys for listening and watching. Follow our TikTok, it. Butter That Bread, YouTube, Butter That Bread, Instagram, Butter That Bread underscore podcast. Thank you guys for listening. This was Butter That Bread Podcast. We'll see you yes, next sir. week. Later.